<laughs> who who do you keep saying Gerald Powell and Piera Jerry? Who are these people? Uh, Gerald Poe. Yeah. Is the uh, the phenom that couldn't ever get his grades? You know, he went over to the uh, Hargrave Military Institute, and he went to the little uh, side school because he couldn't get his grades up. But he's uh, he's a little man child on the line, and uh, of course, Parade Jerry is hurt. But you know that's that's kind of the uh, that's kind of the, the 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 players that we've had. I mean, he's with the Falcons now, right? I believe he is. Yeah, and was starting uh, until he got hurt. I know. I saw the first couple of Falcons game, and uh, he was starting for him until he got his injury. So. Um, Hey, hey, Rick and Barry, I'm gonna have to sign sign off at this point. I gotta go and uh, get me an adult uh, beverage and, uh, <laughs> <laughs> and some other activities planned for the night. Hey, I've had my adult beverage going since we started. <laughs> hey, this has been great, man. I'm glad to meet you, even though it's on yes, the sir. internet. I hope to see somebody someday. Sure. And, uh, you know, if we can get Rick up here, I doubt it. You know, he's stuck down there in Texas, so he won't leave. But uh, we can get him up here. That'd be great. Oh yeah, we'll hey, we'll have to all get get together for a game. Y'all should be at the Grove this weekend, having fun. Yeah. yeah. Hey, Right, okay, hey, wait enough. a minute. Wait, wait, give me Cheryl, wait on wait give me two minutes here. Two minutes. I gotta okay. ask you something else. Okay. I just we're gonna go real quick with this. We've got okay, we've got Arkansas playing Auburn, right? Yeah. Sherelle, pick a winner. I'm taking Arkansas on that one. Baron, pick a winner. Arkansas. I'm picking Auburn because Arkansas plays no defense whatsoever. DJ's picking Arkansas, too. Yeah. Okay, we well, all picking Arkansas. Y'all ain't drinking the, 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 the uh, Ole Miss punch yet, are you? Um, you the Auburn punch. The Auburn punch, I'm sorry. I hate, oh, he's a roll tie. Um, okay, so what what other game we got? Um, well, we got Mississippi State playing Houston. I'm picking uh, Houston. Who y'all got? Jarrell. Baron. Well, you'd have, to, you'd have to be retarded if you took Mississippi State, so I'm taking Houston. Well, y'all know Houston got beat by UTEP. Hey, who is coached by a former uh, Alabama head coach? Oh, that, the titty bar guy? Okay, yeah. DJ's got <laughs> – DJ's picking Mississippi State on that one. He, he's got an SEC West homer in the house. Okay. So, so Rick, you think that uh, – that, that Houston is going to come off that loss and go play Mississippi State and just lay down? No, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm picking Miss, I'm picking Mississippi State because the titty bar guy. Uh, I'm picking Mississippi State because um, I want them to, to to win that game because we look so shitty playing them up in Starkville. <laughs> okay, that's a good reason. <laughs> No, I, I I think Mississippi State's going in the right direction. I, I think um, uh, I, I like what they're doing up there, and I, I'm rooting for them. So I'm just being a Homer SEC West fan on this one, and I hope they win. Uh, okay, uh, Tennessee, Georgia. Who you got, Sherelle? Georgia, back on the winning track. Georgia's back on the winning track. What about you, Baron? Coming off a loss to LSU like that, they're pissed. They're going to beat Tennessee like a drum. Okay, I'm ticking Georgia too because I hate Lane Kiffin. Um, LSU, LSU, Florida. Y'all didn't pick a winner. Sherelle, who you got? Ooh, DJ's uh, got Tennessee on that one too. Who you got, Sherelle? Uh, shoot, I'm gonna go with hell, Florida. I guess. Okay, well, it ain't hell. I mean, they 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 lead in every deep uh, statistic category known to man. So that's a good pick. What about you, Baron? Uh, I'm gonna have to say that LSU has not found their running game yet, and Florida's gonna roll. No, we have not. That that's a good point. If LSU, I think we have got a running game going because we finally got 95 yards from Mr. Charles Scott, even if it was 33 at the last play of the game. 
But yeah, if we don't get our running game going, cause we're it's going to be a long night for LSU, just as bad as it was last year. DJ's yeah. got LSU on that one too. Good call, DJ. <laughs> That's why the party's so good before the game. Yeah, yeah absolutely. But I, I'm going to pick. I'm going to pick LSU in this one because of the intangibles. I'm, I'm I'm going to assume that we're going to start keep improving week to week, and you know this Tebow thing. I, I'm not I, – I don't think – I think Brantley's a good quarterback, and I'm not going to say they're going to lose because he's going to be starting, but there's a possibility the kid's going to get rattled in Tiger Stadium at night. Even though – It's going to get loud. Yeah, even though Myers had two weeks to prepare the kid, you know. So, you know, but if that happens, I mean, I'll, you know, I think everybody in the country is going to be pulling for LSU. I know the Bama fans will because, hell, they want to be ranked number one. I hear you. And then you got, you know, then you got Texas playing Oklahoma, what, the next week? And, and, and hell, Oklahoma's pissed, too. Hey, Rick, I got my three-year-old running in here. It's about to get crazy, so I'm going to have to roll. All right, yeah, we all got to go. Game in Oxford. I hope to see you, Sherelle. 